Hello, Internets, and welcome back to Final Fantasy III on the Super Nintendo. I'm Pink Deadpool, and in the last episode, we got some of Terra's backstory, which was kind of emotional, actually. They they weren't dancing, let's put it that way. Um, and then we came across this Imperial base, which was empty. So we're now standing on this bridge on our way to uh, a cave, a very nasty cave. Okay, yeah. As you can see, we are rocking some of our highest level people today. We got Terra, Locke, Edgar, and Mog as our, our staple group right now, I believe. Every one of them should have an Esper. Every one of them does. It's awesome. And we're going to continue on. Cave to the Sealed Gate. It's a nice, eerie tune that we've heard, actually, in the last video. And Assassin, which I believe is a blade for Shadow and Locke. Uh, I'm not going to equip it because a lot of enemies are susceptible to the instant KO in this uh, dungeon. But some of them who are also come right back. So I'm not going to use the Assassin Blade. Ings, actually, I think are one of them that will flat out come right back. Here, I'm just going to have everybody fight. These are whole new enemies, so we're not even really sure what they're exactly weak against. It's been so long, but I know I hate that fucking move. Ugh, I hate that move. God damn, I hate that move. Hmm. Oh, we didn't get his other dance. I thought we did get that. Oh, well. After we're done here, I'm gonna have to get some more of his dances, because he's got quite a few, and they're all extremely useful. Like that cave-in, just added a sap damage to that ing. Yes! Alright, one... There we go! 555, two magic points, Edgar gained a level, lock gained a level, we got a bunch of GP. GP will be fluent in this dungeon, which is great. Alright, uh, this is one of the first puzzles, so I pretty much have to sit here and watch the screen to find out exactly where I need to go. Yep. Oh. Okay. Whew. What's in, what's in here? An X potion. Sweet. All right. So right down to the end. Right here. Oop. Alright. <laughs> this freaked me out, sorry. I wasn't expecting a fight right there for some reason. I don't, I don't... Ah, okay, okay, okay. I should have did this after combat, but I just wasn't thinking. Sorry. I'm gonna have her heal everybody. Have him capture from the Zombone. I'm gonna try the flash. I'm gonna see if flash will work. I'm not really sure how these enemies' magic defenses are. But we'll see. Could have been worse, could have been better. God damn, stop doing that to her. Jesus. Okay, ooh, an amulet. Oh yes, okay, that's that's an accessory that's very handy gonna have to have her just be on... Shit, I shouldn't have done that to her. Fuck. Fudge, fudge, fudge. Good job, guys. Good job. Moving on. Let's get here. Basement 3. Okay. So... Oh, there's an item there, so I should go back up here. Shh. Get him with the cave-in. Hit him with the cave-in. Get him with the cave-in. Get him with the... Ooh! Wow, that was nice damage. I need to do that more often. There goes the Zombone. Peace out, Zombone. So, note the self. Have Bog dance the hell out of this place. Just be all dancing. Be the dancing fool of the Moogle clan. I don't know what I was trying to say there. Oh god, no. That's, see, that's one of the moves I'm not sure about, because I think the Eng might come back. No. Yes. Mogler bolt. Mogler dice. 
Fuck on fire! <sighs> so, oh wow, he's only at 12% for life. I think we're gonna have to change his Esper. Well, I'm just gonna have to give him... I guess Stray. Stray is the only one I can think of, because I'm not waiting that long for life. Life is way too slow at this point. I know I get one later that will give me life like freaking... Damn! It'd be amazing, but all right. Um. Okay, so she's got a while on Carbuncle, a little bit of time anyway, not not too much longer. Uh, ooh, he's got Cure too. I didn't even realize that. He'll have Remedy here very soon. And once he gets the spell, I can take the uh, Esper off him, so he can learn something else from some other Esper. Still got a bit to go on that, so that should be the last time I check my espers for a little bit here. What's this item? Received ether. Perfect. Oh, ethers are very useful at this point, especially since I have very limited magical capabilities. All right, Mog, you know what to do. Just dance, dance like you've never danced before. Good job. And between you and Edgar, you guys are going to take out at least one, which is awesome. That's perfect. Amazing. Keep her freaking fold up on health. Should be able to just ride this uh, dungeon through. I think I'm at a good level where I'm not going to have too much trouble with it, which is uh, really handy. But this one and I think the next episode might be a little long. Well, at least I'm, this one might be, because it's a very long dungeon. Yeah. This is actually one of the longest dungeons in the first half of the game. So, I don't mind doing it. I like I like the, this dungeon, because uh, this is where you start to get a lot of the rare items, if you know where you're going. And... This dungeon also, yeah, I think that's good. Uh, this dungeon also is pretty much the start of the snowball effect of this story in the game. Pretty much from this point on, it's just going to bombard us with story now. I think uh, a couple points there might be like little, kind of like valleys where instead of we're instead of hills in storyline. If you get what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying. You know. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you, you know. Bob back there. Bob knows. He knows. He knows. David? David? I know you probably need to catch on a little bit, but that's okay. It's okay, man. I don't judge you. You're alright in my book. Just keep it up. Keep it up. Uh, Edgar learned here and scan. Yes, Tara learned life. She, did she just auto-learn that for being level 18? I think so. Because I gave her something that didn't have life on it. Yeah. So she just learned that all on her own, which is perfect. Because, uh, well, life is extremely useful. Alright, that's something I'm going to have to come back to in a bit. There's a, there's a little bit of backtracking in this dungeon. It's actually a theme that will appear a lot later in the the game too. There will be backtracking a lot, and I'll probably have to cut it out too. And later. Oh no, no, I don't want it more. Not yet. We'll save the uh, morph ability. Terra's morph ability. We'll save that for our first boss fight, so that way I can really show it off. Show its full power and capability. Okay. All right. So I'll heal after this fight, so pretty much after I get out of this. this. Alright, anyway, continuing on, uh, I need to pull this, unfortunately. It makes me fall down here. Heard a distant sound. That's something I wanted to hear. Uh, you know, I just finished this fight, and I had somebody level up. And that is another reason why I love this, this dungeon, is because... They, they hand out levels like candy, and it's, oh, it's so nice. I like the levels. I like getting levels. Oh, another Jinji glove. Oh. 
Oh, it's so nice. That's so nice. Okay. So I didn't have to go back for that. I didn't have to go back for that thing. That's great. That's a great thing. I thought I was gonna have to go back and it's even better because it's a Gigi glove. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm I'm having too I'm having fun. I'm starting to have fun now. Which is good. Which is good. I like having fun playing this game. This game's so much fun anyway. I'm having fun. <laughs> Stop! No, no, stop it with the life shaver. You're gonna make me not have fun. <laughs> Elf fire. You're gonna take somebody out with that mog. Goodbye. Oh no. Oh no. That's right. That fire heals them. Snare. Snare. Good job. Use the snare. Snare is good. Bye bye. Bye bye. Edgar learned to end the dots. Lock learned remedy, which is good. But those are good. Goods. 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 Um, one of these is a fight. The other one will open up this thing and give me a save point. Let me see. Oh. Of course, I'd pick the one with the pot for the fight. Because I'm amazing. In every sort of the way. So, oh wow, we got a preemptive attack on him. That's a first. So we're going to take full advantage of this. And have him cave do his dance. He's going to drill. And it's dead. Goodbye, ninja. Poof. N nuts! I thought I had the monopoly on the stuff buried in the plaza beneath the grand stairway. Ugh. So, uh, we just got a clue. There is apparently some items a little bit in, later on in this dungeon. Receive the tent. They gave you a tent here because they figure you're getting low on your HPs and MPs. And I'm doing alright actually on the, on on my uh, magical cap magical capabilities. <laughs> there we go. I didn't mean to do that, but that's okay. Item tincture, boom. I I I want to I want to stop, but I know this is like the halfway point of the dungeon, and the next half of the dungeon is. You know what? I'm just gonna keep going. I'm just gonna keep going. I apologize now for the chance of it being a long episode. Just in case it is, I'm not sure if it's going to be. But I apologize now if this ends up being a longer than usual episode of Final Fantasy III on the Super Nintendo. But if it's not, awesome. Oh god, I hope this... okay, whew. Because it's right over lava, so I was like, I really hope the bridge doesn't come out from under me. So, alright, we go down here... We go down here and up this way because there's an item box. I received another ether, which is that's nice. It's good. All right, moving on. Moving on. It was good. Good. Where do I go? <laughs> I got. I'm slightly confused. I'm sorry. I for forgot about that. That returning mechanic. I don't really know where exactly where I'm going. There we go. I'm out. I'm free. I'm free from the freaking thing that I couldn't see where I was going. I'm free. Received elixir. Ooh, that's well worth it. What's this? Stairs that go that way. Huh. Hmm. Oh, okay, I see what I can do. I think I just screwed myself out of that fucking item. Okay, now, I believe if I step on that... So many freaking random encounters. Like, I get three fights, three steps, and... Three fights, and then... 
three fights and then three three steps and then okay as I was saying before I got into that random encounter I think if I step on that button there that'll open up the door that you can kind of see right above where my sprite is but I don't know it's been so long since I played this I could be wrong my memory serves me well yet again what do we got oh we got a random encounter yeah. we needed to run from that cuz as you can see I did not fare well in that last fight so all right, let's try and grab these items. Ooh, a magicite. Another ether. More magicite. Atma weapon. Oh, I'm so glad the items that I got are at the bottom of the list. So, summons a random esper for magicite. That could be beneficial, but that could also be a very big hindrance. So, that one I might have to use, uh, kind of cautiously At, Atma weapon sword transforms at level up grows stronger as HP increases Terra Celeste Locke and Edgar can use it battle power question mark question mark question mark because it, it gets more powerful with you so I think at this point we should equip that um Okay, so, yeah, I've had to cut a bunch. Alright, I need to... There's a lot gonna be cut out. There's so many fights that I've gotten into in this thing. Uh, that's where I came from, so I need to go up with this. <laughs> oh, I'm not making this episode easy for me to cut today. Alright, so I need to go back up here. That should... What did that even do? Oh, okay, okay, okay. I'm following the puzzle now. I'm following it. There's a switch inside. What will you do? Flick the switch or leave it alone? Let's flick it. I'm just gonna flick it. Okay. I was expecting something horrible to happen, but nothing happened. Nothing horrible happened, so we're good. Magicite! Nice! More Magicite! That's good. Alright, I forgot I was even commentating there for a second, so I'm sorry for the dead air. But, I think we're pretty close to the end here. We should be. We should be. Alright, I think... Yeah, we should be pretty close to done here. Okay, so I can't go anywhere that way. Alright, yes. I don't want to go any further. I'm going to end this video here. Right here. Because the next next bit's gonna be a bunch of story and I believe we might even get into a boss fight so again I apologize for the flag you know for there not being much in this episode but just like a dungeon crawl finding a few items which were pretty actually pretty nice but uh so I don't know why I'm apologizing we actually did complete some stuff we got a bunch of level up, level ups a bunch of people learned a bunch of magic and a bunch of stuff happened on this bunch of awesome episode I don't know why I just started talking like that, but okay. <laughs> anyway, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up button under the screen. If you really like it and want to see more, subscribe and be on the lookout for more. I'm Bing Deadpool. This has been Final Fantasy III on the Super Nintendo. Thank you for watching, and we will see each other in the next video. Till then, peace out. Ah, oh god. Whoa, what the fuck was that? No, 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 no. Take your bucket. He's got a pillow. Iron Hobbit uses pillows to beat people up. Write that down. Three. You're a garble snack.